Every year I get perpetually more and more amazed at how low Fox News has fallen. It's not that they were ever good. But back in the day they would at least, you know, do their little tap dance to pretend to be, we're fair and balanced. They'd have O'Reilly go out there and, you know, 90% of the time he's attacking Democrats. But then 10% of the time he throws it in there to attack Republicans just to keep this veneer of respectability and seriousness. That's gone. That is more than gone. Okay, look at this headline in Raw Story. Fox News introduces sponsored prayers to Jesus. Thank you again for this partnership. So, let me play the video for you. <laughs> You'll get a sense of how insane this is. It's the fifth Sunday of Lent, and our prayer series continues with a reading of prayer from the Hallow app. We all need it. Let's do it this morning. Close your eyes, if you would. Bow your head. Jesus, today we begin the holy period of Passion Tide. In these last two weeks of Lent, help us understand the mystery of your sacrifice and surrender. Make us keenly aware of your love for us. We ask that you make yourself known to us. Help us to feel the grace of your presence. You journey to the cross for our sake. May we see ourselves the way you see us. Come to believe that we are worthy of your abounding love. In these final days of Lent, help us to follow your holy example. Inspire in us the same sacrificial, selfless love, selfless love you showed on the cross. Oh, Jesus, we surrender ourselves to you. Take care of everything. Thank you again to Hallow for this partnership during Lent. Amen. Amen. Cut to a segment where they cheer on the carpet bombing of Palestinian babies. Oh, Jesus, how we yearn to act like you with love and compassion. Anyway, let's cheerlead the carpet bombing of babies in Palestine. Let's talk, let's give more tax cuts to billionaires. That's the, the, you know, the seamless transition is this to Donald Trump should be an emperor, overlord, God, king. Yes, yes. All hail Trump. Okay, this was, without a doubt, the most Fox News segment I've ever seen. Why? Think about it. You have the over-the-top, preening, virtue-signaling, Fundamentalist Christianity. All hold to say a prayer. Speak the words of our Lord. You saw one of the hosts did the sign of the cross? So there's that. So the hyper-Christianity shit mixed with, what was it ultimately? It was an ad. It was an ad for some Jesus-y app. So you get hyper-capitalism mixed with Hyper religiosity. All with the, you know, under the guise of, look, we're wearing suits and ties and we're on a beautiful set. We're very serious people. We're as serious as they come. Look at us. What am I going to do with these people? Imagine, guys. You might say, Kyle, this is low hanging fruit. You know, this is like shooting fish in a barrel. This is the number one news network in the country. This is one of the most popular shows on that news network. That's what this is. And they're stopping to pray to Jesus in the middle of the show and do an ad for this app. What am I supposed to do with this, man? What am I supposed to do with this? So anyway, look, ironically, but God bless if you if this is what you want to watch. <laughs> this is this is what you think is telling you the truth. Oh, uh, imagine all the harm they have done to this country, this network has. And now they're reaching their final form. Hey, y'all, do me a favor and like and subscribe. It helps out big time in the algorithm. Click the bell as well for notifications when videos drop. And watch that video on screen right now. You know you want to.